Look, Ephesians 6, 10 to 18. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God. Put, put what? On the whole armor of God, that you may be able to stand against the, the wiles of the devil. For we do not wrestle against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this age, against spiritual hosts of wickedness in the heavenly places. Man, all of these are happening in our time and age. We are fighting against spirits, not against flesh. Therefore, take up the whole armor of God again, that you may be able to withstand the evil day. You want to survive the 21st century, you must put the full armor of God. And having done all to stand, stand therefore, having girded your waist with truth, not lies, with truth, having put on the breastplate of righteousness, not evilness, and having shot your feet with the preparation of the gospel of peace, not with false information but with the word of god not with the lies of the world equip yourself with the holy bible above all taking the shield of faith and with you will be able to quench all the fiery darts of the wicked one meaning satan and take the helmet of salvation the blood of christ the cross is your helmet of salvation the cross And the sword of the Spirit, the Word of God, the Bible, is the sword of the Spirit, which is the Word of God. There it is. Praying always. When was the last time you prayed, my child? When was the last time you, kne you knelt on the ground, on, on that floor, in your room? No, I'm not talking about the church. At home. Have you forgotten your homes need to be churches? The church starts at home, not here. If Christ is not at home, you won't find him here, my beloved. Do not make your homes a place for Satan to dwell. Make it a home for Christ to be in. Stop watching this and that. Stop hanging pictures of Hollywood, Illuminati's, evil worshippers, pictures on your, on your walls. I'm yelling because it's urgent. It's urgent. There is not much time left. Praying always with all prayer and supplication in the Spirit, being watchful to this end, and all perseverance and supplication for all the saints. My beloved, this is the Father talking here through, uh, through St. Paul. Put on the whole armor of God, the Father. Father. 